Hi everyone. So today we are going to create the URLs. The good news is the URLs is going to be much quicker than the views and the serializers. So for that, we just have to create here urls.py. And the goal of the URLs is when you click in certain URL, you are going to create to trigger these views that we have created. So let's do this. Here from Django dot where else we are going to import path. And after we have to import the views from our views. We have to say list rate quiz or quiz question. or retrieve update destroy quiz or quiz question or and or quiz question detail mm -hmm, that way next let's create our URL patterns And our first one is going to be like empty here. It's going to be a list, create quiz, and we in class base you always have to put as view. And the name is going to be quiz list. After next one, we're going to create the path here is going to be a little different. It's going to be an int and quiz ID. If update as view and the name is going to be equal to quiz detail. Next, let's go for the URL of the questions. Don't forget the comma here. But it's going to be question int quiz ID. Post this quiz question name. We're going to name it questions. Here, the path is going to be questions detail, not even detail. Let's just add these that way. As view forgot the view here and the name here going to be going to be question detail and for here we have everything. Now we have to add this path in our main paths. Where else? So it's going to be here. So from here we are going to Django where else, and we also want the include and we are going to name our path API V1 and quiz. Here, let's include 
the quiz dot urls as a string okay now it's a moment of two the moment of doing some tests but now let's see what you already have what are the errors that you have here okay and you have you can see that we have something related with the views the views.py so let's see the views line six okay here we forgot what this okay so let's check this if it's still working correctly okay i think we are so now if you go for example to the 8000 you see that error page not found because now we have or the admin or that newly path that we created and let's go to that one api action one quiz okay and i think everything it's going good so by coming here we just we just can see that we are retrieving our list of quiz we can get the question count the question count it's correct let me check okay yes for the quiz of the year we have two questions okay which is good and now let's try to create a quick quiz here so it's going to be named quiz three for testing we click on post and that we have the quiz was created successfully and you see question count we have zero because we have not had any question and now if we come again here we can see that we have the three quiz that one that you already had created in the database and this one that you created just now and that's all for this video in the next one we are going to formalize the requests and test all our paths in on postman and there we are going to test the same urls but also the other ones that we have created so if you enjoyed this video put a like share and subscribe and see you in the next one